That's actually a really great question. I've fielded that question from the, uh, the field quite often too. Uh, the concern is that uh, the word pictures and how the report's gonna be written are gonna be a little bit different. Not everybody will be what we know as a five today. So people are asking, hey, that means less opportunity to be promoted. And that in and of itself is a false statement. All promotions are based on the authorized and strength and promotion stats for each AFSC. So let's just take an example. If an AFSC requires 20 new staff sergeants this year, they will get 20 new staff sergeants, regardless of how the performance reporting system works. So there won't be a reduction because of enlisted evaluation system. That's all based on four strength numbers. So um, there will be no change in that process. Some people will be more highly promotable than others. Uh, so there's that fact. If somebody is a high performing airman today, the assumption is they will be high performing tomorrow and be highly promotable just the same. Uh, and this new evaluation system is simply gonna try and separate more clearly who the high performers are in their primary duty first uh, with the, without alleviating the uh, whole person concept, that is still a factor, from those who are not as high performing as they are.